Okay, we got the new Army Combat Boot, Desert Boot, and uh, they kind of pretty bad shape. Been been worn for a while. Uh, I've got worse pair, but sometimes this one right here, it's got that shiny spot right there. Just you know, it's not the suede look like it should be. So they sell little. Uh, cleaners for them little brushes and erasers to get the dirt off That's kind of bad here on the top so I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna show you how to do it quick and easy and uh, show you how to get these things cleaned up okay here we are now before we do the boots we need to get a good workspace going so uh, clear off your workspace and uh, we're going to be working with a power tool make sure you ain't got no cans of gas up on your workbench Woo, that, that'll mess you up hey get your boots okay now we got our workplace clean Don't make sure you ain't got it around your feet. Okay, next thing you need is a grinder. Grinder got a wire brush on it. Now, I ain't got no fancy shop or anything like that. I just got a garage. I make do with what I can, find something at the auction, get it and bring it here. So my grinder is just a electric motor. You need a wire brush on it. Secure it down so it don't roll all around on you. I tried this, hold that with my foot. It just didn't work too good. So. Clamp it down so your grinder won't water around on you. Don't have to be real tight. You don't want to crush the motor in there. That's going to work. Okay. Plug her in. Before you plug her in, what you got to do? We got to be safe. We don't want none of these wires poking out in the eye. So, we got to get safety glasses. I got to find my safety glasses. Uh, I don't hardly use them. Uh, I used to use them. Put on your safety glasses because we got to be safe. If you ain't worn them in a few years, you might want to clean them because they get dust on them. So put on safety glasses so you can uh, won't get nothing stuck off in your eye. Have to go to the doctor. Plug her in. There we go. Okay. The key when you clean your boots. Just take your boot, here's what you're going to do, you're going to hit it on this wheel, just every direction you can. And when you do, it's going to rough it up and clean it all up real good. So, you know, just kind of go around here, and just hit it up there. You probably may need to work gloves. I don't. Just run it in different directions so that you know you're, you're not just. Look at that. Ain't that pretty? Got a little bit of dirty, but it's all roughed up nice and pretty. So. Now 
You can even get on this part here. Don't dig on it too much, but you can get in there. Clean the bottom off of your sole. I don't know, you wouldn't want to clean that. That don't do you no good, but you can get on the side real nice and pretty. I haven't done no testing to see how much you can do to get away with it before you start wearing out your leather. You just get a little leather dust all around here from the leather. Go up and down your eyelets. Woo, look at that! I took that shoelace out. There you go. One down, one to go. Well, I think that's about it. So, uh, this looks really good to me. And, uh, you know, I'm getting looking at these and, uh, they look pretty near brand new. So, um, I bet you, if I had a receipt, I could probably take them back to clothing and sales and get my money back, because they look brand new. Well, good luck in your endeavors. Hope you uh, have good luck. Just kind of figure your own techniques, and uh, good luck doing this, and uh, hope you, you enjoy doing it. Bye-bye.